What's up everybody, this is MGBC bringing you another episode of Skyblock on play.jevnation.net and today we actually got a lot of cool things to be working on um, we do got to work on a cactus farm for some money maybe even a baker sugar cane farm um, but if you guys look at the right hand side you can actually see that our island level is 21.51126 and so many other numbers but the good part about that is if we go to IS then click on island ch or challenges you can actually see that the novice builder is to get your island to level 20 so we can actually get that which will unlock the builders rank so um, let's just do that you get the eight pieces of dirt eight sand and eight emeralds um, the rewards I'm not too sure um, they just give you twenty dollars and then twenty XP but let's do this boom let's see what we got from that uh, rewards twenty, uh, XP rewards twenty, currency rewards twenty, um, eight dirt, eight sand, and eight emeralds. So we can just add that to us. The sand's gonna be good for the cactus farm, so I'm super excited about that. Um, let's see. Now that we've gotten that done, guys, we actually can do the builders challenge. Lumberjack, eighteen of each wood, uh, one hundred and twenty-eight torches. Uh, make all stone tools, carpenter, uh, fences, okay, so all fences and trap doors and ladders, um, 64 stone bricks, and mob farm that will click, mob and loot, 64, so we can pretty much do, wait, what's this one? Furnishing, uh, a bed block, crafting table, glass, wooden doors, furnace, bookshelf, and torch. So, I want to say we can be able, we're able to do all of this. Um, I don't know if we're going to have time. The one thing that I really want to work on is the money source right here. If you actually look, we do have $27,000, but I feel like we need to make more money um, for right now, just so we can buy more iron and stuff like that, because I was trying to... Um, trying to get uh, my plan is to try to get iron just through mining um, by mining the blocks but it is super hard we've probably gone through like a dub of cobblestone for uh, for like I think it was like 15 15 iron so it's pretty crazy so um, some of the people like Buddha belly and uh, uh, Dakota and people like that they actually sell iron on their island so I think I feel like that would be a better way until we can get an iron um, golem spawner working um, in the near future I think that would probably be the best way just so we don't have to keep going through a ton of uh, cobblestone so I want to try to get as much money as I possibly can and let's actually put away like the spruce sapling well saplings are actually uh, one way to go so I think I'm going to sell some of the saplings let's lead up so we'll be able to run and so you can see we've got a ton of saplings so I'm actually going to take like, two stacks of these guys uh, we'll take this guy and we'll leave this yeah there you go and then that will be pretty much I want to try to keep like at least a stack of every sapling I might start planting jungle saplings because I might try to use that uh, that wood sometime. Um, I might want to redesign this. I'm not 100% sure, but we got all of that. And if we run over here, I believe we got a ton of pumpkins. Yep, we got two stacks of pump pumpkins, and then the melons. We got tons of melons. There's heaps and heaps of melons. So this is gonna be a lot of money right here. Alright, so we'll do like this. And since Ave Kang is not allowed, I don't know if I'm going to make a cactus farm. I might just, you know, for when I'm running around. But I don't know if it will be worth it. So I believe we have a ton of sugar cane. Yeah, tons and tons. Alright, so what we're going to actually do right now is uh, let's go to um, shop and see if I have to make these. Yeah, so I have to make these into 
M melon seeds and pumpkin seeds. Let's do that real quick. Bada bing, bada boom. All right, guys. So we ended up doing that. We got a ton of pumpkins. I didn't know pumpkin gave you four seeds, but that's awesome. So if we actually go to slash shop, but and then we go to farmables, and then you go to, you right click this to sell. You get five thousand dollars, or I can get five thousand dollars for all these pumpkin seeds. So that is awesome. We made. We had 512 pumpkin seeds. Wow. Alright, so let's go to the melon seeds. We'll sell those. We'll get 10,000. Perfect. And then we have these saplings. Sell the saplings. Another 3,000. Uh, these, we'll get another 1,000. So we're actually making a lot of money right now. Um, we do have an AH, but I'm not too sure how good it is or how active it is. I don't really pay attention to it that much, um, but let's sell all of the sugar gain. You know that, all that money. Um, why don't you put this? Oh, we actually got a challenge key. Awesome. So let's actually sell this, and then we'll go open up that crate real quick. Ten dollars. So we get nineteen thousand out of that. Forty-seven thousand dollars right now. Let's fill that up real quick. Alrighty. Bada bing, bada boom. Alright, so let's go open that crate. What crates? Perfect. Alright, so we got this challenge crate key. Let's open that. Three, two, one. Get that done. Party crate key. Awesome. Alright, party. Party, party, hey, All right, and go. Come on, give me good luck. You know, I'll take the water bucket because uh, I always need, I always need buckets, right? Since I'm, I'm always complaining about iron, iron this, iron that, I always need iron. So okay, so another bit we got that done. Um, let's close that door real quick. Let's see. Let's see if I come down here. I might want to make that cac cactus farm right now. Since, you know, the, sands are, the sand is super expensive. But we do need to get some kind of money source going. Um, we got the automated smell. Um, oh, this is all full. Okay, so we'll just take all this out. I was super confused of why. Um why that was stuck. Alright, so let's actually break this up. There's four. We'll break this up into four. We'll break this up into four. We'll just separate this evenly. Get that going. Perfect. Alright. So we'll put that in there. There. There and there. Perfect. So we got this. This actually works pretty amazing. Um the one thing I forgot to do is uh, put a little top on it so when they're bouncing up and down, sometimes they were, they died. Oh, hey, party key and an ultra key. All right, well, what's our luck? Man, sweet. Uh, your votes have been applied. All right, cool. So we got that those two th to open, but like I was saying, like sometimes they hop up and down like, like this all the way down, and then by the time they jump up, and then they drop down they die so I put the little area there I died like three four times so that was terrible but uh um, now they don't bounce as much and so now tons and tons of mobs are coming um, so that's awesome the other thing is I put this lapis border around I don't know just to make it look nice it goes all the way around um, I gotta finish up the bottom right there with gold um, it's just something to get the island up but I didn't want to make pillars going all the way up I don't know, it's just, <clears throat> I wanted to try to in, uh, put all the ores into, like, the actual island itself. So, that's something that we're trying to do. Um, let's open up these, you know, let's go back to Warp Crate. And see what we get for these. Um, the tokens are actually pretty, um, pretty cool, too. 
Um, if you actually go to token shop, you can buy XP, enchantment levels, mon you can exchange your tokens for money. Um, the other thing that you can do is uh, buy like those wings uh, that they have in 1.9. Um, and you can also buy um, mining spawners. So I don't know if I'm going to save for the mining spawner ones um, just so I can be able to move mine um, around and stuff. Or I might sell them for like, I don't know, $1,000 per one. Uh, ooh, two common crates, uh, crate keys. Let's open up those. But I think if I can get like, I don't know, I'm not too sure. Um, tell me what you guys think I should do with my tokens, if I should sell them. Um, or if I should save them up for, for, what? I thought I had money. What? Alright, anyway, super confused about that. Um, but yeah, tell me if you guys think I should sell my tokens or if I should save them up for like the mining spawners. Just let me know down in the comment section below. Um, that way, you know, we can work together on this. Uh, ooh, boots. Sweet. What does it do? One on feet, armor toughness, armor, armor toughness. Okay. So I believe that's all the keys. Any more keys that they, you want to hand me for free? No? Okay, cool. So let's go to warp, or the ISO. Home. Let's go back home. And then let me see if anybody uh, is selling some iron. And uh, I will be right back. Alright, guys. Well, as you can see in my inventory, um, unfortunately, I decided to... Uh, go grab a drink of water because I was still looking for people to sell iron I had, I bought like 17 iron from uh, Buddha belly or something like that and uh, and everything was going fine and I come back from the game, grabbing the water and I guess a zombie knocked me off of the world so I died um, but yeah so I think that's gonna end up the episode I gotta grab all the you know um, all the materials all over again to, you know, get to back to where I was with the Fortune 3 pick and everything. But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, t next episode, we, we will be working on the Cactus Farm. So that's going to be awesome. It's going to make us a ton of money. Um, I think after that episode, we will be working on finishing up all the challenges for the builder. And then start working on our island level once again. Uh, and yeah, that'll be it, guys. And then... Um, I'll talk to you next time. Peace.